Welcome to week nine, Scotch families. I'm Lachlan Archibald, uh, head of Douglas House and student wellbeing leader. And I'm here in my capacity as a student wellbeing leader to talk to you a little bit about house. Whenever we talk about house, I think it's really important to come back to our purpose of house. Our purpose is to build communities where students are known, valued, nurtured, and challenged. And a couple of the key people in helping us head to house deliver that and build those communities are our house captains. Ari and Gabe, why don't you guys uh, introduce yourselves and tell us about your house. Like Mr Archibald said, I'm Ari and I'm the senior house captain of Douglas House, which I think Mr Archibald and I can both agree is the better house. I'm Gabe Ruslos and I'm the middle school McGregor house captain, also the best house. <laughs> Thanks Gabe. Thanks Ari. It's been a really hectic start to our term in, uh, in house, despite some of the COVID restrictions, everything's still been going uh, full bore. From our individual year eight to year nine, year 10 wellbeing lessons, where we've covered concepts from belonging through to consent and academic fitness, through to everything that's been going on uh, outside of the classroom, whether that's the Say Shield, whether that's welcoming a new bunch of year sevens to the, to the college or uh, a mentor program. Ari, um, what can you tell us about how, what we've done to introduce our year sevens into house this year? Well, through Douglas, we've introduced our year sevens by doing a range of different activities. One of them was get to know you bingo. So we had a bingo sheet with all these little fun fact questions and we went around through the year sevens and year 12s to answer these questions, which helped get the start going on with getting to know some of the year sevens and year 12s. Similarly, we did profiling of year seven. So that's where we got a group of year sevens and year 12s together. And then we asked them a bunch of questions about themselves create a little profile to present to the whole house to introduce Year 7s more. Uh, with Athletics Day, we're also making sure the Year 7s and Year 12s are coordinating their costumes together, which will also create and make a bond with the Year 7s and Year 12s, making them feel more welcome. Beautiful, thanks Ari. Ultimately, what our house captains are trying to do is build that sense of belonging. As wellbeing leaders, we know that protective, that huge protective factor that a sense of belonging uh, to a school has for our students. So these guys' work in building that is so important. Running alongside House is our mentor program, which runs on, on Tuesdays and Thursdays and in the Friday forum time. Gabe, what can you tell us about what's been going in your middle school mentor so far this term? So in mentor, we've been goal setting, which helps us write a student reflection in our report. And every now and then we'd go and kick the footy on the oval, just enjoy the environment. Huge range of activities going on in Mentor, which are all ultimately trying to address our students' academic fitness, social fitness, psychological fitness, and physical fitness. Getting all those elements of Scotch fit in there. One of the aspects that we're really conscious of within our house program is that balance between collaboration and competition between our houses. Ari, what can you tell us, tell us about how you've been collaborating with the other house captains this year? Um, so coming from the senior captain point of view, we're making sure that all senior captains come out to those house events to make sure that through all the houses you can see that there is a big support system that want to see you achieve and do well. We're also making sure that as soon as we have a good idea that we want to implement through our house that we share it because we want to make sure everyone through Scotch has the same Scotch experience through house and mentor. One of the more visible aspects of our house program is the Say Shield, where our houses will compete against each other in a vast array of activities. This wide range of activities that we have on offer really allow us to value all the different contributions that students can make to house and sometimes challenge students to step a little bit outside their comfort zone. Gabe, what can you tell me about some of the house competitions you've been competing in so far this year? So McGregor has done well in big draw and chess. We came second in big draw and we're in the grand final in chess against Douglas. In big draw, you draw pictures and it's all lots of fun, goes towards say shield. So we've also done European House Ball, which was really fun. All the houses got out and about. There was a big crowd surrounding that and it was really fun to play some more physical house activities. We've also in the middle of doing oratory, which is really fun. And we also get the year 12s to coach and mentor the younger year levels, which is great connecting those bonds. And all these activities are really great because there's a variety of different things where everyone has different strengths in, which brings your house and your group together more, which I think is a really good thing that Scotch participates in. Thanks guys. We're really celebrating the creativity, the academics, and that physical sporting aspect, along with Dr. Newton's favourite, the oratory. I probably can't summarise any better than one of our Year 11s did last week. At Scotch, house is where the home is. Mm -hmm.